This is wait. I mean, this tire would right. still be on the vehicle for oh, right. <laughs> what three, four months. Yeah, I've learned right. that when they're bald like this, bald a lot the of the toxins that have been leached out, so they're actually a lot better like this. Yeah, we yeah, that's why you talked about that too. I've been working on that. <coughs> so are we all here for everybody that needs to be? When we started, uh -huh. okay. pouring down rain. So just to sort of be clear, how, show me who's going to go with me back to the pest insecticide to make sure we don't have more than half. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Well, we don't want less than half either. <laughs> so I only have four. Okay, five. I think there's a couple folks in there too that are going to... Okay, yeah. good. I'm not sure how long it will take to do one versus the other, but um, we may send you some sort of after we get back to the that could happen here. Yeah. After we get through the room, this <laughs> So the first thing you do is, is when you get a stash of <coughs> tires that hopefully are free, because in the U.S. these are usually free, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. They aren't in Haiti. You put your knee on it and you, you see if it bulges. If it bulges, then you're good to go. All right? Mm. If you put your knee on it and you hurt your knee, as soon as you put it on there, <laughs> get you know, don't take it. There's no reason. <coughs> if you get, if you really want to be macho, then you know you're welcome to try, but it's not. It's not going to be fun. Then what you do? <coughs> Bob has a knife. We always work with machetes because everybody has machetes. You sharpen the machete pretty good, right? You don't want to try doing this with the dull machete. It's going to be painful. So get a sharp machete and then just do a slice right there. People always ask, how can you cut through the, the wire? But the reality is the tires have wire in the tread, but not in the sidewalk, mm -hmm. right? I mean, is, am I wrong? Or no, is there, are there exceptions? I don't think so. You're trying to try aiming at that line there. Right. Somebody <coughs> called it a bead. Does that make sense? A bead? Yeah. No? I, I didn't think it did either, but since they said it, it, they said it with an authori authoritative voice. The bead voice. is actually that part. This part? Yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. And there's metal in there, I right? I call this the sidewall. Is that yeah, a sidewall? Sidewall. It is a sidewall. It's soft all the way around. <coughs> so what you do then is you just start. Bob, is that your machete? No, that's his. This oh, is okay. mine. He, he brought that's it. That's why it's sharp. <laughs> he brought it. Well, no, it was I dull. That <laughs> <laughs> I guess that yeah, wasn't the carry-on. <laughs> 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 yeah, I was wondering how they got How'd that you get it through? You know, your baggage? Check, check bag. Yeah, yeah. And you just stick it in your check bag. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't? I think, yeah, maybe that was. You have to ask Jenny. Since we're a family, they put arbitrarily put names to each of the bags. And I think there's always something exciting that happens. Jenny and the girls and I travel. I think the machete was part of that. <laughs> <laughs> they had the, they called Jenny because her name was on my bag to go look at some stuff she was carrying in my bag. And she had no idea what it was. <laughs> Why do you have a machete? <laughs> was the machete one of the things? No, it was um, sugar. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I had a packet of. Um, brown, like uh, farmer-made sugar, mm. type of sugar that they're able to produce. Mm. They, the farmer grows the, corn, the cane, he processes the cane with molasses, and then processes the molasses into sugar. So I brought a package of that. that Someone thought it was drugs? Mm. Yeah. 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 That's, I'm sure that was this is the Dominican Republic. Yeah. <laughs> so the key thing here is that the more you pull up on this, the faster you go. Mm. You just don't want to cut yourself. yourself. Right. <laughs> and with a small tire, it may be hard, but with a bigger tire, you can actually have someone help you with this part. You know? Bob, actually try that. See if I can do it without cutting you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought you wanted me to cut it. You pull this out of yeah. the way. Oh, no. He's See? keeping the machete. <laughs> Man, look at him go. Yeah, that's a lot faster. Whoa. Just Stay close to oh, it. Pull, pull. Yeah. Hold on, Bob. Hold on. Stay close to it. I've never seen one. I've never seen one done. No, but oh, Chris everybody's Chris done them. Yeah. Yeah. They had. It was a wrestling man. Was it a bigger tire or bigger. Or you just did it? No, no, it's the inverting it that's the wrestling match. The cutting part, I, I kind of figured it out. Yeah. Yeah. These, these are souvenirs. They didn't want to touch <laughs> this is a great uh, frame for the Go ahead. picture on the wall. Go ahead, Gordon. Invert that tire. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the tire.
So I'm going to show you what my Tiga does, right? And I've never been really successful at this. But this is what he does. He goes... Except that when he does it... <laughs> it goes in. It goes in. But it goes in almost the whole way. Wow. So... That's a start, but it's not the really important start. This is the important. Right. Once yep. you've done that, you're good to go. <laughs> Uh, with this car, probably so. Nice. Man! So it's better to get small tires? Or yeah. Large well, they don't grow. It's better to get the ones in tires are, are more fun. I would think the bigger the tire, yeah. the easier yeah. it is yeah. to manipulate. Mm -hmm. So you get about halfway around, right? Yeah. yeah. When you get to this, if you're working, what I was, Bob and I were talking, he said he had a neighbor who came over <coughs> and helped him. The trick about having a neighbor who helps you or anybody who helps you with this part is that you have to they have to be coordinated so that you're both doing the same thing at the same time otherwise you're making it worse yeah because you have to you have to get this right in the middle and you don't want to lose what you're starting with right and you don't want to lose what you start with wow that's the hard part it's a wrestling match <laughs> Woo! There you go. bravo yeah. hey. Oh, uh -huh. man.